He fits perfectly in this Padres lineup. Hello, everybody, and welcome to Blue Jays Today, or should I say San Diego Padres Today. Mm. I'm your host, Adam Peddle. And I'm your host, Nicholas Playalog. And today, breaking news, the San Diego Padres have made a big move, acquiring second baseman and outfielder Adam Frazier from the Pittsburgh Pirates. We are going to break it down right here, guys. But if you're new, please hit the subscribe button. Please hit the like button. So much more trade yes. content coming this week. Oh, my God. All right, dude. <laughs> These San Diego Padres, we knew that they were good. We knew that they had Tatis. Yeah. We knew that they had Machado. We knew yeah. that they had Cronenworth, Huge. Myers, need I go on? Now, they go out and they acquire who I thought was one of the best bargains this trade deadline in Adam Frazier. Tell Huge. us a Huge. little bit about Adam Frazier. Guys, you don't even need me to tell you. You know this man leads the MLB in hits with 125. Mm. This guy slashes 327, 392, and a slugging of 457. Three, excuse me. Not a big slugger, but mm. man, you put this guy at the top of your lineup to set the table. Yeah. Good things are going to happen. And what's great about this guy, too, he's second base, but he could also play outfield. Mm -hmm. That's big for the Padres because they were looking at people like Joey Gallo, right? Mm. But the Padres lineup is so versatile. They have guys that can move all over the place. So yeah. he fits perfectly perfectly in this Padres lineup. Mm -hmm. What do you think about this deal, Nick? What okay, do you think about well, this deal? Well, let's look at what they had to give up for yeah. this guy. They gave up their fifth ranked prospect, an infielder guy. I'm going to butcher his name. I apologize. Mm -hmm. uh, Tusipita Mar uh, Marcano or yeah. Marceno. Apologies. Yeah. Uh, please correct us in the chat. Please. Phonetically how you say that. Uh, this guy's ETA in the MLB was 2021. So that's kind of interesting right. to me. I mean, like, it seems like he could come up very soon. He was doing really good uh, in the minors and whatnot. They also gave mm. up uh, a, a right-handed pitcher, Michael Milano, and outfielder Jack Suwinski. And those guys are not super high on their prospect list. But fifth-ranked yes. prospect. That's well, a lot. It's interesting you said, like, Mercado, like, he's doing really well. He's mm. high up there. He should have played this year. But that's probably the reason why they traded him. Mm -hmm. He should be in the major leagues. And there is a giant log jam happening right now. He's an infielder. You got Cronenworth. You got Tatis. You yeah. got Machado and Hosmer. That's a log jam. Mm -hmm. You're, you're not going to see that be ch not changing anytime soon. So it makes sense for them to trade him away. Mm -hmm. Adam Frazier is a guy. I like this trade for Pittsburgh side and oh, hell. No. I like this trade for the Padres, too, because Absolutely. they're in a win-now mentality. Yes, yes. And Adam Frazier, not only does he help you win now, but he also helps you win next year because Adam Frazier has another year left on his contract. <laughs> He's got an arbitration. He's getting paid uh, $4.3 this year. It's not even going to be that much for the Padres because already, you know, we're halfway through the year. So now they can get this guy. They can get him back for next year. And like you said, when I'm looking at some of the best guys that I want at the top of my lineup, I want a guy with a 327 batting average and yeah. an OPS of 844. This guy is solid. He's going to score a lot of runs. So, I mean, I love this deal for the Padres. Yeah. Lots of versatility there. And like you said, I love it for the Pirates too because yes, Adam yes. Frazier wasn't really a guy before this. No, season. no, he was nothing. You're 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 hoping at best he can have a good season like this. He's a, he made an all-star team, leading mm -hmm. the league in hits. Like this guy turned into an absolute gem at the trade deadline. Yes. Good return for them that uh Mercano should definitely be playing if not already with them next year for sure. It's a good start to the rebuild for the Pirates, yeah. and it's an even better start to a World Series run. Actually, this is probably the third year now going for the World Series, mm. the Padres. So yeah. good luck to the Padres. I'm rooting for you out there. Yeah. We're all the way up here in Canada. I'm rooting for you down southwest. Absolutely, absolutely, bro. Uh, final thoughts on the Padres, man. 58 and 44 right now. Mm -hmm. I mean, we mm -hmm. already loved them postseason-wise. Did they go out? Did they add anything else, or is this the final thing for them? I think they might add another arm. I think they do have an arm. There's been some injuries there. Don't know. Not mm. super familiar team, but that's what I've been hearing. Yeah. Go add another arm. Their lineup's pretty solid. Doesn't yes. look like they're going to be adding maybe too much more. This was the big piece. This was, this the, was big the big piece. piece. They needed and it the, is a great piece. Yes, they needed a good bat, and they literally got the best bat in the game, uh, arguably. Vladimir Groh Jr., best hitter in the game in Adam Frazier. Uh, yeah, um, yeah. Or, or, or were you ta Tatis, you mean? Uh, well, no. I mean, Vladimir Groh Jr. Oh, yeah, is the yeah, best. Yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah. Tatis is really good, too. Yeah, yes, yes, of course. Yes, but yes. Uh, I do think you guys <laughs> go out, you get one yeah. more arm. 
I love you for the World Series. Mm -hmm. I already really like this team. Um, but great trade yeah. on both ends, Pittsburgh and the Padres. Guys, please let us know in the comments down below your thoughts on this deal. I am so excited. We have entered the <laughs> trade deadline window. We got this noti. We're like, all right, let's pump it out. This is so cool. So many more videos coming from you guys, or from, from us, us to you guys about every trade that's gonna be happening this week. So stay tuned for that. And please let us know in the comments your thoughts on this deal. Yes, guys. And if you don't wanna look at our faces, you can listen to us on Spotify, Google Podcasts, Anchor Radio, Public and Breaker. Also check us out on our social media platforms, Instagram, Twitter, TikTok. And as well, guys, if you wanna become a Patreon, it's $3 a month and you can become a Patreon and come onto our show and join this wonderful, wonderful graphic here with all the names of everyone who's a Patreon. Shout out and thank you to all those guys. And as well, this video is brought to you by Monkey Knife Fight and Manscaped. Use, to, use code today, Jays, and get the discounts of deals like you saw in this video. Mm -hmm. And that's everything, guys. Yes, yes, my friends. Thank you so much for watching. And go, go Jays, go! go!